swimming in toys. All right. What sorry. do we do? Oh, sorry. is such a metaphor for China because it's a bridge between the future and the past. For thousands of years, China was exactly this, part of the old world and old world thinking and philosophy. Now it's moving rapidly into this capitalism structure. Hey, once again, I'm in the car and I'm the only non-Asian. <laughs> Do I look like these guys? A little bit. Your eyes. <laughs> Alright, today we're going to the Shanghai Propaganda Poster Art Center. This is the Chinese Propaganda Poster Art Center bathroom right here. And the Chinese Propaganda Poster Art Center bathroom for the women. These posters are how Chairman Mao and the Communist Party of China informed and restored the collective mind of the Chinese people. It turns out the Chinese are not big fans of Americans. This is the Tumblr room. Mad porno scent. That's a lot of Mao. Did that look like me? Yeah. It's really interesting to see how they developed and created propaganda around Mao during his reign in the mid-1900s. That was a time when there wasn't internet around, television was just getting started, so in order for them to spur the movement, they relied on these beautifully created posters and paintings, idealized depictions of Mao and the Chinese people. Let's keep it moving, this is the hunters passing through in Shanghai. All right, we're here at the Buddhist temple here in Shanghai. We're gonna go upstairs and check out the Jade Buddha statue. It's gonna be kind of awesome. Are you ready? Oh, sorry. Bye. still choose the original song. How do you get to the lunar soul? Lunar soul. Let me see. Uh, there. Uh, we want to go to the one Take us through the exhibition. All right. All right. Welcome to Nike Lab X15 in Shanghai. This is the second floor. We got exhibitions here. Right now we have the Air Jordan 29. This is the words of wisdom of our the man Tinker. He is the man behind all the Jordans. This is the exhibition. We have Jordan 1. These are all dissected. The 11s, the Concords, 28, and then we got the 29. 29 right here. This is the crazy shit. This is the lightest, lightest Jordan shoe ever. Come check out the store. I love the hundreds too. It's like enter the void. Bye -bye. Later. Thanks guys. White rabbit candy, yo. That's tight. I'll eat it. Both is pig? And the, uh, this one? Johnny and I just had some of the best soup we've ever had in our lives at this little corner stand right here in Shanghai, and it cost us $1.25. I'm gonna call it maybe better than anything we ate in Hong Kong. As good as. Great, Johnny Boom Boom? As, it was. As good as anything oh, good. we ate in Hong Kong. You and anything we ate at Yardbird? Anything we ate in Hong Kong. <laughs> it was so good. Look at this building! Oh my god! This is fucking nuts! I am scared to go up there right now. I'm scared of heights.
What's up everybody? We're at the Shanghai World Financial Center Observatory. This is the world's highest observatory. There are certain parts of this when you look down it's glass, you can see the street. There was a crew of guys working just a few hundred feet below us. You have incredible views of the city. My legs are shaking. I am so nervous. I'm very scared of heights. This kind of is awesome and it kind of sucks at the same time. <laughs> We are on the Kowloon side of Hong Kong. <laughs> 